remotes. This one is the television remote. This one is the uh, video conference remote. Uh, to turn on the television, you press this red button at the top, just like on your TV at home. Can I get a point it at it first, if that helps? Um, if this is off, which I think that it was on from this morning, this will just be turned sideways, the camera, and you can just hit any button to wake it up on this gray remote. And it'll turn and give you this screen. Um, so if th this is what you're presented with from your base start. Um, if you want to call somebody, you take your gray remote, and there is everything you're going to do pretty much is right here. There's four arrows and a check mark, and you use those to navigate. Check mark advances, you know, and the arrows take you up and down and such. Um, so we'll go to call, press enter, phone book, enter my contacts, enter. And then I just know that there's no one in this room in Seattle because I just looked, so I'm going to call them just to show you how. So we press OK. So now you're given the list over here. Call is already highlighted. You press OK again. So there we go, that's super easy to hang it up right on here. There are uh, one button's green, one button's red, they both look like phones. The red one hangs up the call. And there we go, now we're all hung up. Um, two, I'm gonna recall them real quick, just to show the only other thing you can do in this room, which is why this room is easy and I love it, um, is present a computer, which we don't have one right now, but I will show you how to do it. Um, all you do is, so you're, you're connected, you got your thing ready to go. If you just hit OK, it'll bring up the menu again. And then you scroll down to presentation, and you can see the little bullet, and no presentation is currently filled in. So you just make sure that you have PC highlighted, and click OK. And right here in the table, there is a VGA cord, so if somebody has a laptop, they can just plug it in right here. It's already all built in. You just put it on presentation PC, and it'll come right up. And to go back, back to just the camera view, because they're done with their presentation, you just go back to presentation and highlight no presentation. We're back to full view. So that is really all you can do with this system, thankfully. Uh, it makes it a lot easier. Yes? What about external calls? So like you, outside VCs without Schwabi members? Okay. So those are always tricky and always unique because everybody has different systems. The reason ours works so well is because we have all Cisco units and everything. Um, what you do for that is you just start, it'll be an IP address. Um, it'll be like, you know, 192.9, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Um, you just start dialing it just like this. Um, just, you just start dialing the numbers and it will call, I mean, then you call it. But for those, for my time here, that was something I always got IT involved in um, every time, just because if you're doing that, it's probably uh, client related and stuff because it does cost money and uh, then I would always want to make sure that it was going to be exactly right. So. Um, when dialing in the IP number, do you use decimal points or do you just type in the numbers? Decimal points. Okay. You, yeah, you dial it in exactly as shown. So, okay. Yeah. You want to do some on job training real quick? We got a Lindsay McReynolds at maybe 15 minutes in here. What video? Video comp. Uh, it's uh, 